Welcome to clickmyproject.com Now we discuss about the product a high performance fingerprint matching system for large databases based on GPU Now we will discuss about the abstract Fingerprints are the most commonly used biometric feature used for the person authentication Fingerprint recognition is the ancient and more efficient method they can be characterized through some particular elements called Minute. Nowadays, the Minute Cylinder code is the best performing algorithm in terms of accuracy. In this paper, we present a algorithm based on fingerprint matching system based on MCC. This process gives the better platform for reducing the computational cost of the fingerprint recognition system. This process involves to enhance the fingerprint matching and the time of the computation is very low. This process is more reliable because the minute and ridges are combined together to extract the information from the fingerprint. The neighborhood distance of each minute is calculated and the distance calculation gives the better matching point of the fingerprint recognition. As we summarized, the region of interest is selected and the segmentation is done using the thresholding. Then the minute is found using the centroids. Then the authentication result will be as a comparison of minute distance. Now we discuss about the flow diagram for the process. At first, the input image is taken from the dataset. Then the input image is undergoing for the Pre-processing step. In pre-processing step, we have to consider the major three things. First one is filtering. Then second one is binary conversion. Then third one is thinned binary. In the filtering step, we have filtered the noise from the image. For removing the noise from the image, we have used the median filter to filter the noise from the image. After the filtering process, the binary conversion is undertaken. In binary conversion, the image is converted into binary format. The binary format is nothing but the image having only two values, zeros and ones. The zeros represent the black areas and the ones represent the white areas. Then the thinned binary conversion is undertaken after the binary image. In thinned binary image, the ridges and the minute are thinned using the binary elimination. Then the region of interest is selected after the pre-processing step. The region of interest is nothing but the selected area which we want to extract the feature from the image. After the region of interest, the minute area and the ridges are find out using the centroids. The centroid of each minute and ridges are denoted as an centroid format. After the minute deduction, the validation is carried out. The validation is nothing but the matching of the fingerprint. Due to the validation, the minimum matching point of the minute distance is calculated by the validation. After the validation, the Gaber filter is used for the feature extraction. By using the Gaber filter, the test feature is extracted from the image. Then the classification is undertaken after the feature extraction. In that classification part, we use the SVM multi SVM classification for the classification process. The multi SVM is nothing but the support vector machine. In that classification part, we trained the feature from the image and the test feature from the image. The both train feature and the test feature combined together to form a classification result. 
the classification result will be in the text format the classification result is nothing but the authenticated result now we discuss about the initial running procedure for the process now select the main underscore gui dot m file then right click on that file then select the third option run now the initial guide window was opened in that you can see several buttons called the push buttons then this is known as the axis now click the button input image now you can see the dataset folder in that the dataset images are located select any one image from the dataset then the selected image will be shown in the axis 1 with the title original scanned image then click the button pre-processing after the pre-processing the pre-processed image will be shown in the axis 1 with the title binary image then click the button thinned binary image after thinned binary image the edges and ridges will be in sharp with the title thinned binary image then click the button binary centroid the neighborhood operation will be done and the binary centroid image will be shown then click the button find centroid after finding the centroid the centroid values are shown as an red color then find the rich centroid after the red centroid the red centroid will be shown as an blue color indication then once again click the red centroid the centroid along with the minute a and the ridges will be shown in a single figure with the title centroid of each ridges then click the button distance calculation in this process the distance is calculated for the each minute a then click the button region of interest the only the region of interested area is calculated as an minute a and the ridges with the title the elimination of unwanted region then click the button matching after clicking the button matching the another guy window will be open in that you can see the button matching after clicking the matching the initial image was shown and the matched will be shown in the edit box this is the text format for the output this authenticated result is shown in the edit box then click the button enhancement after clicking the button enhancement the gaber filter is applied for the image and the feature is extracted then click the button classify after clicking the button classify the matching result is shown in the edit box in the same guy window only then click the button click here to plot the graph then another guy window will be opened then again click the button graph the graph will be shown in the axis the x axis represent the performance and the y axis represent the accuracy then click the button accuracy the accuracy will be shown in the edit box this will be in the percentage the obtained accuracy will be an 82 thank you